Welcome Capricorns. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back Capricorns. Wow. 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 Capricorns. I am amazed sometimes and trust me I'm not one of these people who look at the cards. Capricorns, Capricorns, welcome back. Please remember to a cross watch and see who these people are. That is going to be coming up in your reading. I want to say thank you so much for the warm support. Um, thank you for supporting my channel. Um, we're coming down to the end of this year, Capricorn. Remember to order your Capricorn readings and so that you know what is coming up in 2020 because I need time to study 2020. Um, to let you Capricorns know in the 2020 reading what is going to be coming out. So if you notice a lot of things or if you're a member of the channel and you're a VIP of my channel, you will realize that a whole lot of readings are just coming out to finish off the end of this year so we can look at 2020. So ladies and gentlemen, you have the sign of infinity and I see you are moving on. It's as if this week is clearing up a lot of things. Congrats, Capricorns. What is coming out in this week? You have the energy of the chariot. You're moving forward. Whatever has transpired a week before, you're turning your back. This is the second week. The week is from the 7th until the 13th. You have a fire energy coming in on Monday. On Tuesday, you're breaking down some sort of a deceptiveness that was created in a corporation institution. You're bringing it down. You're blowing it up and you're ending it. I see all the little animals, all the little chipmunks, all the little things that was uh, um, there behind holding you back and creating issues and problems for you. They're out. They're out. It's like, okay, Capricorns is like, all right. <laughs> I have enough of your play. So Monday and Tuesday is going to be a hot, hot time. It's like you're in fire. You're, 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 you're moving. And it's as if whoever you think you are that was trying to block a situation or block me, you Capricorns are like, listen, I am ruled by Saturn. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm ruled by Saturn. So this is what you Capricorn, this is the message in a real diplomatic way. You are letting people know. And I don't know why they don't give, they should have given the Tara card, Wheel of Fortune, Saturn, but it's actually Jupiter. So this week is going to be a fab, fab, fab week for um, you Capricorns, because some sort of an issue that people were creating, you're bringing down a tower moment to this. It's like, bam! Don't have any time to deal with this. This is not happening. Bam, bam. This is over. I got to move on. I got to get out of this situation. So it's as if you Capricorns are like, listen, ladies and gentlemen, I have no time to play your little silly games. I got to keep on moving. Okay. I have no time. I'm like, Capricorns is like cleaning up this week, cleaning up, cleaning up, cleaning up, okay? Because you have your eyes on where you're going to. If you notice, uh, you're healing your heart chakra because a lot of you Capricorn have felt it. You have felt hate, you have felt hurt, you have felt, and you're learning about unconditional love and you're learning that you can love someone from afar, okay? Moving on is about you have a, you have ended uh, this, um, uh, um, project that you are on, okay? If you notice all karmatic situation and people come into your life and you are ending a project, you're moving forward, ending this project, letting this go, and you're moving forward and you're like standing your grounds and looking back for stability. You're creating your stability. And I see people are coming to you. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. And you're like, ladies and gentlemen, I have been telling you um, and I've been showing this up and I've been giving you messages and I've been um, giving secret messages. Uh, and here it is. And I see a whole of you or really learning unconditional love. I think it's about unconditional love in this week. 
um, and you know, you're about to enter your birthday period over the next two weeks. And it's, it's about that you're really learning what is unconditional love and trying to forgive those who have done you wrong, but yet still helping the rest who is open for help. So it's a week where the wheel of fortune is coming in and something that was taken from you is going to be returned and you're going to be finding out a whole lot of secrets. Oh, MK, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, hold on. Oh, MK, ladies and gentlemen, you have only major arcana. All right, Capricorns, now you change the name of the game. I never realized this. Oh, my God. I'm always surprised at what is coming out because I do my um, reading. So... Ladies and gentlemen, you have only major arcana. Only major arcana. It's a yes. Whatever you decide to do, do it Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. OMK. Okay. So it's a week of learning unconditional love. It's a week of um really connecting on a high energy vibration, high frequency. It's a week of love. It's a week of uh, loving, learning to love in something and letting it go, okay? Um, so um, it's a week of changes, um, cycle, stagnation is going to be um, uh, letting up. Our target is, uh, is um, going to be coming in. Um, changes is necessary, okay, for you um, to have your natural rhythm in, a, in the world, okay? It is also true of relationships. So some of you could be um, relationship endings, whatever it is. Let it go. It is time for you to let go of this situation and move on. But it has to do with some sort of a situation that was happening where people were creating a whole lot of problems, a whole lot of issues around you. People were trying to weave their little webs so, um, in order to keep you in place. And I see that you Capricorns decide, hell no. It's not happening. Not happening. Mm -mm. Uh, that's not how it works with me. So I, a whole lot of people were working against you Capricorns. It is a sad situation, but it is true. A whole lot of people was working against you Capricorn in order to keep you. And the major arcana, because if you notice, the major arcanas are coming up in this week and they say no. No, no one have the right to block another person. No one have the right to create issues around another person. And if you notice, you're going to be moving forward. And whatever that was taken will be returned. A tower moment is coming down for a corporation institution. And I see balance is going to be brought back in this corporation institution because they have found out the secrets that was being um, kept in this um, corporation institution and they're releasing these secrets and bringing back ju um, justice and equality, okay? So um, some blockages is going to be ended on Tuesday and I see whatever that was taken from you will be returned and justice will prevail. I see you're moving forward, moving and overcoming some sort of a secrecy that a corporation institution had held and I see troops is going to be coming in so um capricorns there you go this is what i was saying you're standing your ground using the sword of truth in a correct way standing your ground and that is going to be helping you to move forward in a very positive direction a new offer is going to be coming in um for a lot of you a lot of you um who were looking for some sort of a new um, job opportunities, business opportunities. It is going to be here. I see love is going to be offered to you because they realize that a lot of you were worked against. Okay. So if you notice, it's as if some of you wanted and was moving on. You were just going through life, doing your thing and people were just envy of you and was creating a whole lot of issues around you and it's, it's as if the universe came in and said no 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 um you know this person has been trying um to create something to help humanity and no 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 it's like the angels and guides come in and said no no you leave this um this is um 
created, this idea, this situation was created for a good purpose. Oh no. And I see a whole lot of love is going to be offered to you, Capricorns. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, people have find out how people try to work against you and has treated you very, very much unfairly. And I see a new start is going to be coming in for a whole lot of you who were treated unfairly. So ladies and gentlemen, if you have done something horrible to another person, don't expect that in this week you're going to be uh, your wishes and dreams or the universe is going to grant you what you want because you have created your own karma. Victory and success is going to be coming in on Wednesday. Some sort of good information is going to be coming in. Um, some of you were dealing with some tragic situation where people had created a whole lot of issue. Um, but whatever is happening, you are going to be, um, uh, you know, a whole lot of enemies. You're going to be finding out that you had enemies, enemies all around you. Okay. And you're going to be victoriously, successfully overcoming these people. This is what I said, ladies and gentlemen. A lot of people were, um, jealous. Uh, at your work, your business, whatever you were creating, a lot of people had a lot of jealousy and was working against you. You have a lot of enemy and you're going to be finding that out, but you're successfully. A lot of information is going to be coming out. You're going to be finding out a lot of secrets. A lot of information is going to be coming out about what was happening and what was transpiring. People are going to be finding out the truth um, what was happening and how people were creating um, a lot of problems uh, against you. Now, this is wonderful. Um, you guys are the first one to have no reverse cards. And this is just so powerful. You Capricorns have been going through uh, a lot. And for the Capricorns that people have treated you unfairly and injustice, uh, forgiveness is the key. Forgiveness is the key. Let it go. Understand that these people um, need to be forgiven. Um, and it is not one of the most easiest things. Um, but I will forgive and I will teach you um, to forgive. How to forgive. You have to look at it. You weren't the one who created um, this conflict. You were the one who were focusing on um, doing better for humanity. Um, if someone hates you, that is their problem. Let their waste their time hating you because there's nothing you can do for that person not to hate you. Whatever they hate and whatever um, they have against you, that is their problems. Okay, you cannot, under no circumstances, um, taking um, up their problem of they hating you. And this is what I always say: um, you know, let them hate you, but you're you're walking and you're moving forward. So let people hate you because they're wasting a lot of energy. I love this reading for you guys. I see you're victoriously going to be overcoming some sort of issues that people had created for you. I see they're going to be finding out the truth of a cancer, what a cancer have done in, um, uh, in the past. And I see justice is going to be um, coming down on this cancer because they found out the secret of what this cancer have done to a lot of you and they're going to be justified. I see people who were working against your corporation institution. You're balancing this out and I see you just really take it down in a very nice diplomatic way and just balancing out the situation. I see a lot, a lot of you are going to be sitting and, and I, Capricorn don't really laugh, especially when they realize that people were really you know, these enemies were coming at them and I see a corporation start laughing and said, this person know exactly how to get back at people, but in a very smooth way. And I see a corporation institution is saying, okay, I can't fight with this person. I'm going to join this person. And I see that you Capricorns wasn't really fighting. You Capricorns just realized that there was a lot of hate coming at you and a lot of people were happy on a piece of you. Um, you know, it's like you turn around and this crab and it was like you were in a barrel of crabs. Yeah, a lot of you was in a barrel of crab where there was people all over you, all over you. 
um, you're trying to get out of this barrel of crabs and they're pulling you down and they're pulling you back and they're biting on you and they're taking your foot and they're taking your this and you just do one thing, one thing. And I see ooh, and a corporation is sitting down um, on Thursday and is just really laughing at the way you dealt with a situation. So I see a lot of you are going to be overcoming some sort of a situation where you stood your grounds about a situation with a car or some sort of a travel documents or information. You stood your grounds about this and I see um, they are really um, showing you appreciation for this because they had no idea what was going on and I see a new contract is going to be coming in. And you're going to be receiving a start. And I see a lot of people have admiration for you at how you stood up against some sort of a on um, this honest situation that was transpiring and how you dealt with the situation in a very dip diplomatic way, but in a firm way. And I see love is going to be offered to you in this week, uh, Monday, Tuesday and Thursday. They're going to be offering love to you because of the way you had dealt with a situation. On Tuesday, there was some sort of a situation where people were basically blocking you, blocking a contract and that sort of a thing. And now I see they're offering you and excuses and they're trying to work on the situation in order to bring balance. So I see um, there people are going to be offering you love and seeing the work that you have been doing and how you have been helping other people, but also creating um, healthy um, ways for people to communicate and helping people to heal themselves. And this is a, a wonderful situation that is transpiring. On Wednesday and the crowning of the week, it is going to be an absolutely, absolutely fantastic um, time that is going to be coming up and it's going to be transpiring because what we are seeing is that some new start is coming in. Um, something that was stolen from you, people who have created issue. I see some sort of apology is going to be um, coming in for some of you. And I see you're going to be victoriously overcoming some sort of a real deceptive play that a group of people have done and a group of people have created against some of you. You're going to be victoriously overcoming the situation and a judgment call is going to be coming down on these people because they have realized the connection and how these people have worked together in each other in order to create some sort of imbalance. So when it comes on to work, I see some sort of a balance. I see a corporation institution is going to be just sitting down and, and, and looking the, at the way uh, how some of you had dealt with your business and dealt with a way where people were trying to um, created some sort of an issue and you're going to be realizing oh my god this person ha is you know you know take the situation in hand in a very diplomatic way and I see a lot of people are going to be admiring um, what you have done and the way you have done things justice is here and I see it is positive and um, justice over your work it is a very very positive um, because you're going to be receiving some sort of a message and they're going to be re realizing how people have created a whole and you had a whole lot of enemies um, Capricorn and like surprise no you're not surprised um, so there th there was some major situation that was happening to you Capricorn major situation and I see you Capricorns pull this uh, situation uh, um, remove uh, um this puzzle this group of people that was creating issues and situation around you so the eight of cups is moving on and a lot of you are letting go of some sort of issue that was going on you're going to be finding out a whole lot of information on sunday it's as if this could be information that is coming in from an higher spirit However, this is transparent, but a lot of information is going to be coming out on Sunday. I see a lot of you women are standing your ground and an apology is going to be coming in um, to some of you women. And I see you're going to be taking this apology and move on. Please remember to go look at the, first, the second week Capricorns to see what is coming up. This is love. Good news is going to be coming in. Some sort of apology 
a corporation is going to be finding out the way or you dealt with a, a situation. I love you guys. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. It's a powerful week. Namaste. Yeah.